Farewell. I'm Whimsical Ren, your first anchor for today. And I'm Nabila, your second anchor for today. Let's hop right into these crazy announcements. Extra, extra, hear all about it. There will be a pizza day this Friday, January 19th for any students who want to order a slice or two. You need to place your order online through School Cash Online or by using the QR codes on posters throughout the school. Pizzas aren't five, not four, but only three fifty per slice. From Papa John's, and you can choose between cheese or pepperoni pizza. Make sure to place your order by Thursday morning. Pizza will be served in the cafeteria during lunch break. Now on to some other news. EQAO will be happening this Wednesday and Thursday. I hope you're all ready for it. Mm -hmm. Grade 10 science and grade 11 biology students who are taking biology next year are reminded of the parent information meeting for the awesome field trip to Huntsman Marine Science Center in New Brunswick in September. The, oh, wait, the, no, the meeting report. will be this Thursday at 6 p.m. in the evening in the library. Contact Mr. R in the science department for more information. Now we have a quick clip from MSA. I'm gonna say big so what is that? You haven't heard about it? No, I haven't. Let's hear more about it with Shahid. Hey sir, well, on January 16th, the MSA will be hosting a big so during lunch in the rotunda. So be there. Who? I'll find those butter words. What's that in the chair We'll be selling big goods like brownies, cookies, cupcakes, and many more. Now let's head over to the weather with Owen. Hey, so Will, it's me, Owen, your weatherman for today. Let's just bounce right into today's weather forecast. We are, today we are starting off with negative 7 degrees, and later on we are going down to negative 18 degrees, and there would be snow, which is fantastic. Tomorrow it's going to be negative... Uh, 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 11 going up to negative 17 degrees uh, and now we've got this amazing photo of the day it's uh, the sun and some clouds you know completely coincidentally this photo was taken by me and put up here by me after being selected by me uh, if you want to see your photos <laughs> featured here please send them into lawyerlive at googles.com and now we've got a quick message from MSA Hey, sir, well, the day is finally here. The MSA Bake Sale will take place today in the Rotunda during lunch. Make sure to check out our delicious treats like brownies, cookies, cupcakes, and much more. All the funds will be donated to the Humanitarian Relief and Gaza. We accept cash only, so don't forget. Can't, Can't wait, wait to see, see you there! there. Hey, thank you for that crazy weather report. Hey, Nabila, do you know what national day it is today? By golly gee, gosh darn <laughs> gee, gosh golly. I haven't got a clue, Chief. Um, today is national nothing day, and I got nothing. Well, I have a joke for you. What is a pizza's favorite song? What? <sighs> slice, slice, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. You wrote the joke, too. <laughs> I'm so funny. That's all we have for you today, Sir Will. We'd love to see what you like to do that enough, too. Please send your stories, photos, or even videos to us. We can be reached at laurielive at goldgroups.com. <laughs> on Instagram at laurie.live. You can also search us up on YouTube to watch our past shows at Laurie Live. Next up, we have the water fountains in the math hall. Now, these are close to the classes here, but also are close to each other, so it gives them no real priority. They're also slightly more annoying to use so you have a button you have to press to fill up your water bottle instead of just a sensor. This is the water fountain in the science and English hallways. It's near these classes, but not really near anything else. It also has a decent amount of space and doesn't get too crowded. This is the water fountain in the middle of the upstairs hallway. While it's not near many classes, you're likely to pass by it on your way to one of them if you are upstairs. It also has this cool water motif. However, as it is in the middle of the hallway upstairs, it does tend to get crowded. This is the water fountain in the front hallway. There's not too many classes here, but there's a good amount of space and it doesn't tend to get crowded. However, it does also have a bunch of meter press to fill up your water bottle. 